Hi class, good morning. Thank you for joining me today outside of my house in my front garden bed. I'm not sure if you can see it, but I have teeny tiny little daffodil plants peeking out of the ground. It makes me so excited and happy that I am gonna have pretty daffodil, daffodils growing here very, very soon. They're a beautiful sign of spring. While we're out here thinking about how happy I will be when my pretty flowers grow, I think that we should put the words happy, pretty, and flowers into alphabetical order. Happy, pretty, and flower. Happy starts with an H, pretty starts with a P, and flower starts with an F. Which one would come first? Let's look at our alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F. Does one of our words start with an F? It does. Flower would come first in alphabetical order. Let's keep going. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. <gasps> Which word starts with an H? It's happy. So flower comes first then happy. And which word is our last one in alphabetical order? It's pretty. That's correct. I want to give you a closer look at my daffodils that are starting to peek out from the ground. <gasps> Soon they will be very pretty flowers. I am so very happy that I'm soon going to have pretty flowers here. The words happy and pretty both end the same way. They both end with the letter Y. And they have a special sound. They sound like E as in rainy. The Y says E, like in the word rainy. Let's take a look at some other words that have the same special sound as happy and pretty and rainy. Well, there's sleepy, dusty, sandy, fuzzy, dirty, and mighty. I don't mind getting a little dirty here in the garden today because I am so happy that there will soon be pretty flowers here. Today I also want to talk about some suffixes and suffixes go at the end of the word. But we have some special rules when we add suffixes to a word that ends with Y as in rainy. In fact, what we need to do is we need to change the Y to an I often before we add the suffix. So I want to take a look at two different suffixes that we can use with the word happy. The first one is ER. It says ER as in bigger. And if we added ER to the end of happy, it would make the word happier. But we would need to change the Y to an I before we did. What about this suffix? We could add EST, like in the word biggest. We could add EST to happy and it would say happiest but we'd need to change the y to an i before we added them what about the word pretty could we add est to the word pretty could it be the prettiest flower we could but we need to change the y to an i before we added the est could we add e R to the end of the word pretty? Could we have the word prettier? We could. Maybe one flower might be prettier than the other. Before we add the ER to the word pretty, we need to change the Y to an I and then add ER. Let's look at some other words that have the ER as in bigger sound. Helper softer, slower, smaller, kinder, and louder. I hope that while you're at home that you are kinder and that you are a helper. 
Let's look at some words that end with E-S-T. Kindest, loudest, shortest, tallest, softest, and smallest. I want you to be the kindest children while you're at home with your moms and dads. And I know you can be. Have a great day. Bye-bye.